Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Monday, December 3rd, 2018. The tarot card for today is the Three of Pentacles. I find myself feeling all kinds of things with this one today. Now, as we know, Mercury has retrograded back into the sign of Scorpio and will not go direct for three more days. Venus, which is moving forward, has moved into the sign of Scorpio. And at some point in your day today, the moon will join in and also be in Scorpio. Now, yesterday we talked about how difficult Mercury retrograde in Sagittarius may have been and how we had seen that card, you know, a month apart. Okay, so here you are, you know, getting that load together, getting ready to go, you know, kind of just trudging forward. You can't really do anything just yet, but what can you do? You can certainly plan, and this is a card that involves planning, sometimes teamwork, but you know, yesterday's card kind of showed you maybe wanting to, you know, do this yourself. Maybe not wanting to leave anything to chance. Perhaps not wanting to delegate. So, you know, I think that there is a, an underlying theme there of looking at what it takes to get the job done. It doesn't have to be at your job. But, you know, you may be faced with these things because the Venus retrograde and the Mercury retrograde have had you reviewing you know, various things in your life, including relationships. So there may be some questions involved here, you know, like how you function as a unit and is it worthwhile? Do you have a good team of people around you? You see, we're getting very close here because now today's the third. And as I said, Mercury goes direct on the sixth. But if you follow me um, on Patreon, in my members only area on Facebook, then you've heard me speak about the new moon in Sagittarius, which is coming on the 7th. And there's a reason that it's very significant, okay? Because back on November the 8th, we had Jupiter enter Sagittarius for the first time in over 12 years. And Jupiter rules Sagittarius, okay? And this is the best place it's been in all those years. But the kickoff where it really starts to show up in your world and to bring you, you know, the benefits that Jupiter brings is that this new moon that's coming up. Okay, so what do you do right now? Here we go, yesterday, gathering everything together, getting ready to push yourself forward again, you know, trying to get there. Today, looking over those plans, tweaking those plans. And you have heard me talk about making sure that you have a really good set of intentions. And I'm not talking about unrealistic crap, you know, like, let me walk out the door and meet the love of my life. I'm talking about solid intentions that lay forth the life that you need so that it's all well-rounded all the way around, right? For the long term. So what you're working on here, while, you know, some like, ah, oh, these are minor cards, they're extremely significant because while you're not seeing the results just yet, they're coming. They are on their way. And you have to know this because the actions you're taking at this coming new moon are very much determining the long term, your happiness and what you want. So utilize today's extreme energy of Scorpio that's available to you to really dig deep, okay? Because Scorpio is like the great detective. If something hasn't been working and you need to tweak your plans, you need to figure out why. You've got the re-re-re's of Mercury retrograde. Utilize them, take advantage of them come up with plans that will work because the timing is getting much closer to when you can utilize these plans and put them into motion. So I want to thank you all very much for being here and I'll see you again real soon. Take care.